In this video, I will show you how to configure Prisma Access to send websites to browser isolation. Begin by logging into your Prisma admin portal. I've already created a traffic steering policy to send a custom category to browser isolation. So now all I have to do is just go to the custom category and add a website that I want to isolate. Browser isolation lets me give users safe access to a website that my organization may have security concerns about. You can also specify an entire category to send to browser isolation. Simply go back to your traffic steering rule and go to your destinations and select the category that you want to send to browser isolation. Once your change is complete, remember to commit it to Prisma Access. This integration uses a Prisma service connection to send websites to isolation. Integration can also be performed using a block page redirect. Please refer to the joint integration guide for full details on both methods. To test browser isolation, begin by logging into Prisma with the Global Protect client. Once the client is connected, browser isolation will automatically be activated. No proprietary browsers, agent, plugin, or proxy configuration is required. A native user experience is preserved for seamless browsing. When the user navigates to a website configured for browser isolation, all the website code will be executed and isolated away from the user's local network, device, and browser. An optional red frame can be displayed to inform the user that this session is being protected. If there is malware in the website, it will be trapped in isolation and permanently disposed once the browser is closed, leaving the users perfectly safe. This isolation service runs on a scalable cloud and is available from anywhere in the world. Please contact us for more information. Thanks for watching.